Okay, so it turns out my mic was muted, so whoops. <laughs> I, I, so I will resume a trend of the same from where I left off uh, last night. Okay. Hey, Sarah, you are overheat. Understandable, me too. Overheat, overheat this. Okay, all right. Time to play the game. Obahito. Uh, this, uh, this cup. I don't know that last one. So that's just a guess. Oh ne, this ne. See, I, 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 I don't know enough hiragana, which is sad. Obahito desne. Something like that. Oh, it is seminar. No wonder I got confused. Yeah, that's my excuse, but in actuality, I just don't know them at all. <laughs> oh, the, the, the FOE has respawned, so it's been seven days. So, yesterday, I was in, in yesterday's stream, I was talking about how the. Um, FOEs, when you kill them, it takes seven days, you know, in-game days, for them to respawn. And one of them has respawned. The first one I killed. The one right over there. But it's okay, I've already, I've, I've already fully explored behind it, so I, I don't need to worry about it. Well, I haven't actually fully explored, because there's this uh, locked door, but I cannot go through it. So I'll, I'll need a special thing to be able to get there. So I have quote-unquote fully explored the floor. Hey there, Lexicon Artist. Thanks for showing up again. How are you? I just started, so you missed nothing. Unless you missed my voice. Oh no! <laughs> the thought... The thought is a scary one. Oh, give me a second. I'm gonna tab out, so the game's gonna freeze. I, I just need to... Do something for a brief moment here. Yeah, professional stream. I, I type during my streams. <laughs> uh, at work. Lurking, lurking is good. Lurking is great. Lurking is perfect. I couldn't ask for more. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Anyway. Hope everything's doing... Oh, what have I done? Okay, so, um, you know what I'm gonna do? I I'm gonna reload. <laughs> oh my god. Whoops. <laughs> oh, that was an oopsie. I wasn't being careful. So, yeah, hi, fried eyes. So... This is exactly what I was talking before. This FOE is not meant to be fought yet. He basically just one-shots your party members. He actually did not one-shot my tank. The tank was left with 4 HP. That's amazing. 
But yeah, you're not meant to fight that for a while. Uh, mine. Want to get some of those later. Do I do it now or? Uh, just get uh, the skill point here. And maxed front guard. Yes. So how are you today? So, um, I can tell you the same thing that I said a, a moment before. Um, I just started, so you missed nothing. Unless you missed my voice. <laughs> you know what? Screw it, I'm adding it as a quote. I like it. There. That's a quote. <laughs> right, I was also saying, yeah, seven days for FOEs to respawn, because this one has respawned. The first one that I killed, it's now live again. But right now, I'm not interested in killing it again. I'm interested in uh, exploring further into floor three. Three of them? I don't like that. But yeah, how's it going? Oh, I already asked. My bad. Hurt me. Uh, come on. That's fine. It's fine. You know why? No, you don't. But I, if I say it's fine, then it's fine. So I'm gonna take the cheap way out. Not by resetting, but just by running from every battle. Because I know something that you don't. Unless you've played the game before, then, then you know what I intend to do as well. So there's a heal spot nearby, but uh, because I played the game before, I know of that, 
So I'm just gonna go for the heal spot. If I can find it. <laughs> Uh, yes, it does resurrect, yes. Oh, well, I can fight this. finish exploring later. Um, it's not here. I think. Oh, that's a gather spot. Oh, it's a take spot. Can I... Well, the time has come. Get one point and take. I got a crab apple. And an amber lump. Which is what you don't want to find on your body. Okay. Um, yeah. I'll come back to finish mapping this properly. There it is. After passing through the door, you reach a clearing. Without warning, an ear-piercing scream sounds out, followed by the growl of a fierce beast. Mere yards away, a giant wolf is preparing to spring onto an unlucky soldier. The wounded soldier seems to be petrified with horror. You take a step forward. The desire to draw your weapon and rescue the soldier wells up within you. Rescue the soldier? No. I mean, yes. Sorry. As you gird yourself for battle, the faint ringing of a bell reaches your ears. Searching for its source, you find the Hexer. The... Black Gah. I have no idea. Standing quietly there. Her lips scarcely parting, the girl with the ringing bell murmurs a mysterious chant. All at once, the, the wolf that had stood ready to pounce stops moving, its muscles tensed. At a final word from the girl, blood spews from the wolf's jaws and it collapses. They don't hear or see well, the flamed-haired girl whispers, but they can smell blood. Fixing her pale-eyed gaze upon you, the girl approaches. You should be careful. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Hands outstretched, flat gas sprinkles some droplets of shining water on you. The party's HP and TP are fully recovered. I'll tend to this soldier. You should go on. The stairs to the fourth floor are not far. As she speaks, What's her face points you to the back of the room. I'll stay here until you defeat Fenrir. Come back if your wounds become too severe. Uh, the creepy girl turns away, her attention focused on treating the collapsed soldier's wounds. 
The way is clear to continue forth. So yeah, it does revive as well. <laughs> See, I knew of that, so it, it's kind of cheap, but you know, I, I cannot fake not knowing. I can fake other things though. Wait, forget I said that. Yay! Yay, heals! Yeah. Now, going down the... Going through that door at south, it does lead to the fourth floor. But I'll finish exploring this floor. Yay, treasure. Oh, I thought that would kill the ginseng or whatever it's called. Mandrake. Ah, close enough. You hurt me, Roller. You hurt me. Also, can you stop summoning rats? It feels like the start of... Um... Oh, what's it called? I was being witty for a moment, then the name of the game escaped me. It feels like the start of Fallout all over again. I should kill them pretty quick there. Okay. What, another fight already? Oh no, he hit me for eight. And 16 when you, when you don't trigger the shield. Oof. Okay, what is in this? I opened it from the back, apparently. Eureka A. No, I missed the Greek letters. Because it, it was Tyrica Alpha before, Tyrica Beta as well. You know, you can, ra you can lower my defense, that's fine, but if you don't attack, what's the point? You always call them A and B anyway. I think most people do that. Okay, this battle is uh, actually a little rough. The rollers really hurt. And they're kind of half tanky. Um,
Oh, what the heck? Yeah, this group is a little difficult. So let's look over here. Nothing. It's my favorite. I found nothing. I love it. You know what I like to get in a, you know, a, as a birthday gift? You give me a box and it's full of nothing. And then there's nothing after nothing that just comes pouring out of it. It's amazing. That's a reference to something. I didn't come up with that. mapping this room. Hello there. Ah, just the same as those I fought before. They move three, then they stop one. But other than that, they do follow you. It's fine, they struggle to move up and down. Preemptive attack, I'll take it. Probably should have focused the roller, but whatever. What do we have here? Medica 3, it's kind of a waste. Hide boots. Oh, 400 monies. That's always good. Okay. Alright, let's not fight these. I don't want to die. I mean, dying is fun and all, but... I don't feel like it right now. Okay. Um, I'll go back to that shortcut.
the dead end again. Which is okay, but I'm not happy. I'm so unhappy, I have to put a note. Another dead and see it fits, it fits perfectly. kidding me okay you know what I'm gonna do it again because I'm crazy like that Again? Oh no. Don't do this to me, game. When did I ever mistreat you? Aside for calling you names and mistreating you in every way possible, I never did anything weird. Take spot, which I've already done for today. Take. It's just all dead ends. Exactly. Also, uh, unrelated. Actually, related. I've been considering, uh, cons considering doing a thing where I would... It's a trap! It's a trap! Well, I know it's not the... the whatever they're called, the ones that, that just one-shot me at the start of this floor. This is a normal one. So I can probably fight it. If I can't, I'll run away and use a... Um, a shred. I got into a normal battle. Oh yeah, it's it's just a rage lobe. No problem. I have no healing though. 
But I have a level 10 bravery, so that's a lot of extra damage. Yeah, I got this. Okay, scream fail. I'm pretty sure he always opens with scream, which is the thing that can, you know, confuse you on whether it's gone. Yeah, it's confused. Which is basically charm, it makes your party member attack party members only. Just go for damage. Oh yeah, it's boosted the, the physical attack. Twenty one, twenty three, twenty two. It's a triple hit now with boost. See, normally it's two arrows, but with boost, I think it effectively gives plus five levels to the skill. So I think his skill is at level six or something, so it's at level ten with this, meaning. Fires three arrows, even if he's not maxed. It's complete murder. Remember when this guy was hard? It feels so far away. Let's go back to heal. It's really nice to have a full heal inside the dungeon. Everything eases up after this, because, you know, you can explore and then heal and then explore some more. Oh, right, right. Oh my god, I forgot. Thanks for reminding me. Uh, I was considering um, making more characters, like an alchemist, for example, that I would level alongside, you know, the main party. Maybe I would swap one character for the other from time to time. That's what I was thinking of doing. So at least one, because I'd like to have an alchemist for stuff. But that's just a maybe. Because it is troublesome to have to um, to have to worry about leveling multiple people. Because unlike Etrian Odyssey 3, which is the first one that did the thing, I'm not allowed to explain. So unlike Etrian Odyssey 3, I cannot level my main party and at the same time level characters that are at the inn or the 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 guild or whatever that I'm not using currently. Like that thing started in the third game. I think it was a farmer skill. It's vague in my head, I'm not sure anymore. Looks like I answered while, I, while you were typing it. Maybe I should have read. Oh well. Maybe next time. So yeah, this is a permanent heal spot from now from now on. Actually, not permanent. It's only until you kill the boss on floor five. 
which is basically permanent because you don't really come back down here after you, you have beaten floor 5. Auto battle, baby. Game is so easy, I'm using auto battle. Alright, I've basically explored the whole floor. Basically. Sorta, of, kinda. Flame-haired Hexer is standing in the same place as before, her stance unchanged. Gives you a faint nod as she turns to face you. How are you? I hope you're not pushing yourself too hard, she says demurely. As she does, she sprinkles a few more of her shining droplets on you. Water from a spring deep in the forest, she explains, it heals your stamina. The Hexer speaks true. You find your stamina regained as the cool water soaks your, uh, soaks into your skin. Reminder to stay hydrated and drink like I just did. The fourth floor is home to many wolves. Take care. The girl shyly turns her head away after delivering her warning to you. Your strength regained, you feel ready to continue your adventure into the forest. It represents. It re sorry. It represents exactly my feelings. Don't hurt me. You hurt me. didn't want me to have that one, which is okay. It's unacceptable, but it's okay. Yeah, there are no more roller. Oof, that hurt. Okay, we are going deeper into floor. The Depth's Black Teeth. The distant howling of wolves reaches your ears as you venture deeper into the forest. Their wild cries echo through the trees. You suddenly recall what's her face's words. She warned you that this is a dreadful place where feral wolves dwell. You continue forth, the threat of approaching wolves uppermost in your mind. So, fun fact. The first time you meet uh, the, the deer FOE, he murders you, okay? So it, it gives you that fear of FOEs that you should always, like, probably always avoid them, like, at first. 
Well, these are different. These are weaklings. You can kill them just fine. <laughs> Oh, it's a dead end. No, it's a mine spot. Okay. Uh, right. It's not a problem, because I just need to learn a mining skill. Um... I guess you do need the Voltry rear guard for Defender. I do want Defender. Hmm. Well, time to start getting that. Solve. Solve. Bob. I need to mine. Yes, I'm gonna make you mine. Exactly. Metal horn. Paroxene. Oh, it's full. Oh, come on. <laughs> My bag is full, so I cannot obtain the paroxene. But I, I have obtained the, the paroxene from the quest. And the game is reminding me that I have obtained the, the quest item. <laughs> Discovered a new item, paroxene. Even with my bag full. Oh! Oh, maybe it was full after obtaining it. Like, it showed the message at first, but it meant, yeah, it's full now that you obtained the item. And now it tells you the item you got, I guess. Yeah, that, so that's a quest item. Excellent. Well, I guess I, I'll leave now then. Oh, hi there. So, like I said, these are easy. Oh, I should have healed, though. Yeesh, 35? Okay, so they hurt a little, I guess. 34, 33, 29. And it's basically dead. See? Easy FOE. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, gonna get rid of some... Uh, yeah, some of these weakling items. Oh, there's another one. Good. Bring them on. Bring bring them all on. Okay, maybe not all. But yeah, I'll be returning to town now. But I'll be walking out. I'm not gonna use a, a thread. Okay. 
they even give good experience. Which is welcome. Oh, well, hi there! Ah, see, they all turn red. The nearby ones, anyway, maybe not this one over there. Alright, you can't see my mouse. <laughs> you can't see my cursor. This one over there. It doesn't really get aggroed, but these, they do get aggroed if I get into a battle with them. Interesting. What? Don't leave! Lame. Okay, let's go back. So it's gonna take a while, you know, walking out. It's slow. This was before the series did uh, the good shortcuts. Up automatically turning me around. Going back to heal. Can I stop getting this group? group really wants me. I want you too. Ah! Okay, that... that gave me a heart attack, but it's okay. That was on my end. Get over here.
Ah, you have obtained all the material, uh, materials that Shilika requested. So that's my fifth um, hard shell. Which is great, I can sell that now. Oops, wrong place. So much stuff. Minus the pyroxene, I'm not selling that. Hand axe, wax ashi, short bow, bull whip, leaf coat, hide glove, aspis, hide boot, bravant. Bull whip. You have 28. That's a big increase. I'm getting you that. Bone mace? Not yet. Oh, that's going to be such a big upgrade. I look forward to that. Short bow. Big increase once again. For both of you. Alright. Armor. It's kind of expensive for plus one defense. Codes. This is also expensive for plus one defense, but I'll do it because it's the tank, sort of, kind of tank. TP. Eh. Okay, everyone has leaf boots because it gives plus one agility. Okay, this gives strength. That's pretty good. Hmm. I mean, it's just one strength. A hide boot, it's like a leaf boot, but even more agility. I'll do that. Getting turns before enemies is really something that I value. do more damage and so will you good I bought everything oh no no accessories okay that's fine yeah this is fine
All right, from now on, I's gonna have the hand axe for sale. Well, a bit late. I don't even use uh, axes, because I, I don't use a, a lance neck. It came out pretty well, I think. Very light, but easy to use, you see? And afterward, with Valerie's, so don't forget to pick it up. If I think of something else, I'll make another request. I owe you one. Right, that was an old quest. Yeah, this one. I'm just gonna sell the axe. It's free money. Welcome back, kids. Shilika came by, bubbling about the equipment she was able to make. Sounded like you've got another satisfied customer. Keep up the good work, okay? And the pyroxene that I digged up. That's even more money. Welcome back, kids. Found a pyroxene, huh? Keep up the good work. Okay, that was very basic. Alright, we got to floor 4, meaning there's new quests available. Shileka is now in need of materials from which she can craft a short bow fit for explorers. Don't, don't I have a short bow? Yeah. So much for that quest. I go to Shidaka's goods to ask her which materials she needs. She was really pleased with that hand axe, you know? Good luck to you! Jackson Restaurant. Now that's a name. Seeks adventurers talented in the use of fire to satisfy it, its latest request. Alchemists, welcome! Unfortunately, I don't have an alchemist. This is a request from Jackson Restaurant, but, well, it's a strange one. He's requesting a person, not a thing. He wants an alchemist who knows the fire formula. What could he possibly need that for? I mean, it's a restaurant, need fire, use your brain. Anyway, come back with that alchemist, okay? What's this now? Request about the short bow? Ah, you already gathered the materials for that one. I forgot I forgot I made that request. But don't fret, I'll stay I'll still pay the reward. Go see Valerie and pick it up from her, okay? I already bought two short bows. That means I'll sell this one. It's fine, it's still money, I guess. Oh, whoops. It wasn't the same dialogue, dialogue as usual, so I kind of skipped the first part in it. Because normally the first part is always the same. Alright, anyway. Sounded like you've got another satisfied customer. Keep up the good... So it's the second part that was generic. Okay. Um, I need an alchemist. I need to make an alchemist. Let me sell that gear. First of all, the axe, because I don't use a lance neck, and short bow, because my two bow users already have a short bow each. Alright. Looks like I slept for like one hour. <laughs> okay, let me make an alchemist and see what happens. Those who study the control of nature, the power of fire, ice, and lightning is at their command. More sleep than you get most days? Oh no! You need to sleep more! Uh, is there a good, like, alchemist portrait I could use? Uh, I mean, look at them lab coats they are wearing. In Final Fantasy XIV, basically, alchemists wear lab coats like this. Uh, 
how can I stop this? I guess I'll use one of the basic ones. I really don't like these. Eh. I mean, this dude is alright. I wish I could change the hair color. Um, I need a name. Come up with a name. I'll just give it a, a an easy name for anyone to pronounce. There, easy name. Solar Boy Janko. I have no idea what that is. <laughs> It's an old GBA game? Uh, I wouldn't know. I haven't played a lot of GBA. I mean, I played some, but not that. Oh, uh, I need to learn fire. handle on how skills have been changed as far as I can tell there's no changes I looked at the um, I looked at the discussion forum on Steam like just a bit before I started streaming and there's a thread about um, you know the OP thing um, whatever it's called immunize and someone said that immunize works the same way that it did before and if there's one skill that needed a change that's the one so i guess nothing changed as far as i can tell but anyway i can't comment i don't see anything different thieves's alchemist has learned fire that means i can report this quest. So I created this character just for this quest. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'll play this character later. Ah, you learned the fire formula. Congrats. I'll contact Mr. Jackson. Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Mr. Mr. Sorry. I bet he'll have more work for you too. But I still can't figure out what a restaurateur, that's a word, would need with the fire formula. Couldn't it be cooking? Oh no. Anyway, I, I really don't know if anything has changed. I personally cannot comment. I haven't noticed anything. Aside for a name change here and there, I guess. Back to my normal party. Or maybe I should play the alchemist. Huh. Should I do that? <laughs> I kind of want to give the alchemist a few levels at least. Like, just one run, there's no bosses. Okay, there's the wolves, I guess. Okay, fine. And to be clear, I'm fully aware that Immunize is OP. I 
just don't want to use it. I, I don't want... I don't want a broken scale. So I will not use Immunize. On purpose. Because that's the kind of person I am. I guess. Maybe it depends. Honorable? I don't think so. Quick reminder to stay hydrated. I just drink juice, that's why I say that. But like, I'm thinking of you here. You should thank me. <laughs> you, you, you don't need to thank me. My damage is a lot higher because I have a new whip, I have new bows, uh, the tank is still the same damage and the healer uh, still the same damage as well because I don't have... I was lacking one loot item to be able to unlock the next wand which is pretty powerful. So soon I'll be hitting strongly in the front row. About time.
fast. Bravant. I'm gonna be using that against whatever boss is on the floor five. Fenrir, right. Darn. It kind of just showed up in my face, because I wasn't paying attention. But that's okay. I want to fight them anyway. That hurt. Oh, come on, you jerk. Need to stop dying. You know, that's the hard part. I'm just kidding, game's easy. I can just auto battle.
That hurt. Can you stop attacking her? Good grief. They really hate dark hunters. Come back here. Why not? Looks like they actually specifically attack Dark Hunters. Sure feels that way. Oh, not anymore. Never mind. Here we go. That's a lot of pads. Hi there. Okay, you can't say stuff like that on Twitch. It's a joke, you can totally say stuff like that. In fact, I encourage you. Plate. I already have one. Well, I'll sell it for cash.
Oh yeah, I killed all the FOEs on the floor. That was good. That was good experience. Oh, claw fly. I can't handle that. Okay, I can't handle that. I think I'll go back. 46 items. Eh. Oh, I can't heal. I'm one TP off. Oh. Oh. Okay, that's fine. God, that's okay. Oh, a new item. Horn. They say every rose has its thorns, but I never said them say that crabs have their thorns.
Oh, it's the next floor. Floor five. Floor four is very quick. I'll finish mapping out floor four though. Staring down the roar. Back up. Now that I got to floor five, can, um, I can get some new quests back in town. Amrita, nice item. It heals TP, which is good. It's premium, sort of. Yeah, I just want to finish mapping this uh, floor. Then I'll go back to town. If I could stop getting a battle every, like, four steps, that would help. Come on, there we go, it's the new day. You can't hold anymore. I'm sad now. Alright, I'm not gonna walk out this time. Like, I think I make enough money now that I can just use the treads to save time. Gem ring, that's it. Alright, oh, I got this from a chest. I already had one of those and only one of my characters can use that. Chances are I'll want one of these for when I fight the boss. I mean, I, I've reached floor 5, 
Floor 5 is where the first big boss is as part of the quest that I already took. So I'll probably want some of these. So I'm buying some. Uh, slightly decreased defense and increase attack. I didn't know it increased it. I didn't know it decreased defense. But if it increases attack, I might end up using that on uh, Bob for the boss fight. Alright, it's nice to get some of these. Oops. Custom. Alright, maxed cuffs. Ready to learn Defender, which will be a physical defense buff on the entire party. Looking forward to that. It's a buff, so it's for like, I don't know, five turns or something? Four? I know I want to revive sooner or later, but it's so many points. You need you need healer level five. To be able to learn cure three and cure three level three to learn revive. Oh, it needs to be level seven. In fact, healer level seven or revive. It's a lot of levels. And I want to start learning um, TP up for TP region later. And attack up for Caduceus, because, I mean, the whole point of this character is it's a combat medic. But right now there's not much combat going on. <laughs> mm.
reminder to uh, stay hydrated, like I do. Hmm. Low traded? Ah, it's not good though. I don't suggest it, but you know, I'm not your mom, so you can do whatever you want. So what do you mean, cute, cute hexer? You mean the girl that I was talking to on the previous floor? Like your comment came like, I don't know. A minute too late. But that's okay. So it's a story character named Plakga or something like that. I don't know how you pronounce it. An easy way to pronounce the name is to pronounce it that NPC. It's an alternate way. at that end. That's okay. Unfortunately, I still cannot play a Hexer until I unlock it as part of the story, which is sad. I really feel like they could have made Ronin and Hexer available to play from the start of the game in the re like HD remaster. I think that would have been totally fine. Like, it's hardly a story beat. So it's not like it was important to leave it that way. fight that. Oh, a war ball. Okay. New enemy. These guys hurt. These, are, these guys actually hurt. But I dodged it, so it's fine. This thing looks like one of your dad's dogs. Don't tell them that. They might cry. You meanie. Boar spear. 
So, fun fact, there's no spear-type weapon in this game. Which means it's just a name. But it's, it's a sword, right? Yeah, see, it counts as a sword type. That's a lot of attack. Well, you get that. So, Lance Neck, Protector, Dark Hunter, Rubador, and Ronin, irrelevant. Uh, yeah, you can get that. So, now the Protector is the strongest damage dealer <laughs> with the basic physical attack in there. Ooh, 60, and it couldn't get a turn because it's slow. Right, I guess that's the way to handle them. I can actually kill them before they get a turn. Oh. Um, okay. Right, Roto, you played this game, right? Collected all but one item. What were you missing? What are you? Oh, it's just another wolf. Okay. No problem. The elusive ice dragon horn. Oh my god. Back when I played, um, I got to floor 27 28. You know that floor combo because of the pits that bring you to the floor below. And uh, that's where I gave up. Can you stop attacking my Dark Hunter? I'm lucky she didn't die. So I gave up there, so I didn't fully complete the game. Uh, I know I fought one of the dragons, and I think I killed it. But I'm not sure anymore. It's vague in my head. I'm not sure what I want to learn with her right now. TP up for TP region, attack up for Lucius, because I will make a battle medic. Must have killed that thing 20 times, oh no. Did you use this skill? Did you use this freaking broken skill? Oh no! Steam notifications! <laughs> Um, probably, yeah, I thought so. Maybe it's time for Cure 2. Okay, revive is definitely something I'll need. Um, uh, there. Multi hit. I almost have multi hit maxed out for the boss. And uh, I don't know where to go. All oh, right. Ah, okay. So, you need TP up level 5. Which I have. Now I need HP up level... 
No, that's for healing. I need level 7 of songs. I need this level 7. So I need 6 more levels in this, and then I can finally start learning the um, TP healing song. Nice. Yeah, I don't know where to go with the Dark Hunter, though. Whips for more damage. I mean, you can't go wrong with more damage, right? Plus, it affects physical attacks, too, not just skills. Attack up. Should give her attack up. Good. I will want to learn Gag and Shackles later. Let's get Whips. More damage with whips. Right. So, how are you today, Roto? So, so, ah, uh, it sucks when that happens. And the temperature doesn't help. Okay, Koti, are you trying to be in my stream on purpose? Not <laughs> enough, it feels like normal temperature in your room with the AC on. I don't have AC, but I do have a fan blowing basically straight on me, so it works good enough. Another crystal door. A mysterious crystal entwined with ivy blocks your path. It seems you cannot proceed, so this is another door that is, like, well, more than locked, but whatever. So I use this uh, locked door icon. I did. I saw it at the last moment. Oops. Well, this is fine. Thankfully, it's just a wolf. They're still very fast. Fast as heck.
all that for a dead end? Really? Okay. Ugh. Oh, it's a wolf again. Oh, oops. That's gonna hurt. Please don't one-shot me. <laughs> oh, it's another dead end. This one is less annoying than the previous one.
not touching that one. And before this path leads to another dead end, Okay, that hurt. That hurt a lot. to leave. Another large fan. The same here. Huh. The heck is a large fan? Oh wow, another massive bow upgrade. You'll need a large fan. What is a large fan? Oh, is it the thing that the boss drops? Oh no. Wait. Did I ever get a large fang? Large fang... No. So I guess this is the... the, the a drop from the main boss, which means... Get that good gear after floor 5. for the boss. It decreases defense, but I could use this on Bob. He doesn't get targeted much anyway. to go once again. Oh, I'm gonna... Okay, there we go. It's a new day. So I can get these. If you paid attention, I did not heal. I did not spend money on that. Because, you know, I get a full heal anyway, on floor 3, so...
Oh, our game is gonna freeze for a brief moment here. Um, ah, okay. I was just checking something real quick, and when I tab out of the game, it freezes. Sorry about that. Yes, suck. Now I can fight again.
it's another dead end. Okay. You know, I feel like doing something. You know the battle song? Well, it's so rare that we get to hear the full loop. So we're gonna hear we're gonna hear the full loop this battle. Just for fun, I feel like hearing it, that's all. I'll take that time to take my medication. That was the full loop, also I took my meds, so we're ready to murder our plants. Like this. Don't do that in real life. Plants have a will to live too. And if you're unfamiliar with the Supox, well let me tell you, you don't want to mess with them. And there are plants. So respect plants, don't cast fire on them, don't burn plants, you can freeze them though, it's fine. Them. Okay. Challenge accepted. That's a chop. It's a scissor me timbers. Really? 
A preemptive strike. Perfect. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> I don't want to fight these. More doors. More door. Exactly. It's a mine. Your mine. Okay, no SOE. What's in there? Blaze oil. <laughs> A blaze oil. It gives you fire element. Oil that imbues a weapon with the element of fire adds fire damage to normal attacks. Look. Let's be honest, if they give you that and you know you fight the big boss very soon, it means the boss is weak to fire, okay? <laughs> it's a hint. You kind of have to take those hints. Now, I will not fight the boss as soon as I can, though. Because uh, there's still some floor mapping that I've done. I want that to remain progressed by the time I fight the boss. Yeesh. It's not a dead end. There's something. As you are, a wall of trees block your progress. Oh, it's a shortcut. Even better than like a random event. Oh, yay, shortcut. I forgot this was a thing. <laughs> I forgot there was a shortcut here. Oh, that was that's gonna save me a lot of trouble on this floor. Alright, well, there's not much map left to do, so uh, boss is ahead. <laughs> I, I, I think we'll come back. <laughs> Time to leave. Gary has new items in stock. What do you have? Here you got B. Oh, you need one more star seed. 
totally not an item that comes from floor 6 or anything. So hot in your room that a spider <laughs> literally just randomly died and fell directly on your keyboard. Oh no, it's the stuff of nightmares. It's kind of like when I had that um, that that uh, that wasp in my pants. <laughs> Remember? Oh my god, the stuff of nightmares. I tell you. <laughs> oh no, I'm so sorry, Sarah. It's awful. I don't think it died, but it probably fainted from the heat. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, that's awful. Are you okay? Refresh. Refresh is good. I will want that. But anyway, later. Bob. Just in time. Multi-hit maxed out at level 10. Ready for the boss. Which I'm gonna fight basically right now. Well, next run. Um, so I need level 7 songs. Alright, time to save. Alright, boss is ahead. I didn't sleep at the end, so... Is my mic working okay? I just want to be sure. Like, can you hear me well? Alright, thank you. Just fighting enemies along the way, I do, like, fill up my, uh, boost meter a little bit. So by the time I get to the boss, I mean... I'll fight less on floors 4 and 5, though.
book. So where is that? Over there. Okay, almost there. Okay, let's do this. As you continue through the trees, you sense beasts surrounding you on all sides. Their reek is ever present in your nose, while their constant low growl plays on your nerves. You have reached Fenrir's dread lair. And he's not alone. Uh, uh, w w f wait a second. <laughs> uh, what? What? Move back, you jerks. You're supposed to move back to your positions. Oh, God. Why aren't they not moving back to their positions? Okay, that's just wolves. Oh, that works. Let's do this. Just a wolf. No, it's a skull. It's not a wolf. Okay, it's a stronger wolf. Okay. Uh, oh God. Oh, strength increased. Thank you, thank you. Just thirty two. Uh. <laughs> That's not a one shot. It did like 70, 72. She was at like 68. So at full health, it's not a one shot, okay? Uh, still can't get nectars. I mean, I have one from a, a chest, but like that's the only one. Cannot buy these yet. Reviving is really premium. Okay. Let me kill these two. And then go out and back. much damage.
I cannot reach the ones in the back, so... Because they are in the back. Wish I could kill the other ones. Okay. Let's do this again. <laughs> Wait, somebody leveled up. Bob. Bob. As you can see, I'm saving on money by not reviving uh, my character. I'm just doing it later in the dungeon. Which is fine because uh, I don't really need the boost on the healer. I mean, okay, it makes heals stronger, so that would be a great time for an AoE heal that would be like stronger than my normal AoE heal. But it's fine. Erasure now available. Recovery now available. Erase enemies status buffs. Recover party status ailments more quickly. I guess there's applications against certain bosses. Oh, oops. Went down the wrong path.
Alright. Let's do this. Oh, it moves! It moves! Crazy. Okay. Here's the big babu. Defend. Maybe I should have moved the medic in the back. What? I only trade places. I can't just put her in the back. That sucks. Oh, Jesus, that hurt. Don't attack my healer, please stop that. <laughs> yeah, right? That is so strange. <sighs> Slightly decreased defense. Oh, it's only on self. I thought you could use that on a, a targeted party member. Fine, you can have that. Because you'll be attacking every turn after that anyway, probably. Oh, arm bind. Good, 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 good. No sweat. Okay, big damage. Okay, no problem. He does, like, no damage. Thanks to a maxed front guard. Okay, look at my damage. I'm murdering this noob. He's already at half. It's that easy. All you need to do is reach the boss with, like, all, all, every skill that you use is maxed out. It's that, it's that easy. Max out cuffs. Maxed out front guard with defender, which helps at level 2. Maxed out multi-hit, so big damage there. Maxed out bravery, so massive attack buff. That's all you need. You just need to know the game and know that you should max out skills instead of branching out. It's that easy. Oh my god, they're right there. You, can you see the, the skull there, the, the, the other wolf thing? It's one square away from joining, and then there's one right behind. But that's okay, because we're gonna win. Maybe. Oh no. Oh. Here it comes, but it's okay. I've basically won, right? Huh. Let me kill the ads, it's just because it's fun. Totally not gonna bite me in the. Of course not. I'm not being stupid right now or anything. Right? Let's 
see there's no problems whatsoever. Look how tanky I am. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm being, yes, Roto, in the derriere. Uh, that hurt. Okay, let's kill the boss, actually. <laughs> But, but dodge <laughs> that didn't hurt he survived with this amount of health and killed my dark hunter Oh, I still have to kill these guys? Are you kidding me? <laughs> they were supposed to disappear, that's how it works normally. piece of cake kind of <laughs> I got cocky and I knew it but hey you've discovered a new monster Fenrir and a new item the white hide right. So if you have huge DPS, this boss is not really bad, because you can see you could kill it before the adds come in, or like just as soon as one comes in I could have finished him off with a single add, but in the end I fought three of them because I felt like it. Well mostly because I figured, hey, more experience. And more drops, potentially. I thought they would die when the boss dies, though. But yeah, he one shot in my Dark Hunter. It was easy, and then uh, front... I didn't have any more TP for front guard. The primitive jungle. Hey, look! It's a pillar of pink! As you reach the new stratum, you find a mysterious light shining in front of you. As you gaze upon the enigmatic scene, you hear someone descend the stairs behind you. Hey, you know this place indeed. You turn to see two familiar adventurers with smiles on their faces. I don't see the smiles. Can you see the smiles? Because I sure don't. Maybe that's actually a smile for their, you know, their standards. And like a, a frown is like much worse than this. <laughs> well done, thieves explorers. Rid of the wolves, the Emerald Grove again knows peace. Grim satisfaction is evident on the warrior woman Ren's face as she gazes into your eyes. In overcoming hardships and growing stronger, you honor the Explorer's Guild. After defeating Fenrir, you will be known as high-ranking adventurers of Etria. We salute your hard work. May your continued exploration go as well as it has thus far. The pleasantries thus dispensed with, 
Ren points to the unearthly light behind you. See that light? We call it the geomagnetic field and use it to investigate the labyrinth. Truthfully, no one knows what created it or for what purpose, but its power is formidable. Touch it and you will find yourself elsewhere. The Rada's the, the Rada chieftain pioneered its hues. Though you must be eager to explore the new stratum, I advise you to return to town first. Ren and her flame-haired partner brush past you and approach the Pillar of Light. In the blink of an eye, the two of them disappear from where they previously stood. Is this the power of the geomagnetic field? Ren's words stay with you as you continue. We can return to town, save. So interestingly, you can save at your magnetic fields for some reason. Or just, you know, close the window. Return to town, turn in the quest. Right. All oh, right, I don't have a free heal anymore. I will have to revive her the, the expensive way. 160? 10 times level? That is so expensive. White Hide from Fenrir. 830. I'll take that. It's good money. Hide Armor Bri... Bri... Thing? So protectors can use this. How many? Ah, uh, no. The plate is better. It gives HP, but 5 HP at this point is not that good anymore. Um, 5 to 28. Yeah, it's good. Um. It's expensive, but it's fine. I can't afford that. Oh, mid can use this. Using that agility. Eh, fine. Shadow in the Grove. A, bit of, a band of adventurers seeks vengeance by proxy on the unknown beast that attacked them on B5F. Decided to take the request, have you? It's from an explorer who's a regular here. He was ambushed in the forest with his friends by an unknown monster on the fifth floor. It was too much for them to handle, so they panicked and ran away. They said it was a terrible poisonous spider that's usually seen deeper in the labyrinth. You've been around the fifth floor a few times by now, right? The target is a monster that appears on the fifth floor where there'd normally be nothing. Where there would normally be nothing. Get rid of it before more kids like them run afoul of it, okay? I'll be praying for you. Etria's most expressive designer, the lady Mrs. Merrill, must have must have butterfly eyes for use in her new product. Uh, 
This one comes from Mrs. Merle, Etrian's finest designer. Every Etrian girl's dream is to step out wearing the accessories she creates. Her newest design, though, well, she says she needs five insect eyes from butterflies. I'm a fan of her accessories myself, but I might not stand in line for this one. Well then, off you go. So... I will probably not keep this quest, or will I? Huh. I remember this one. You need to kill butterflies in a special way. I think you have to blind them, or you have to kill them with lightning or something. I don't remember exactly, but it's the first butterflies, the ones on floor one, you know? So, I could test a few things. Well, first of all, I have, um... What's his face? I have the the, the thing, the, the dude, the, 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 the caster. I have the alchemist, but I couldn't... I think it's lightning, actually. I think it was. I could just go for it. Maybe later. Prayer to the stars. Believing in their power to draw her desired lover's eye, a girl will pay handsomely for five star-shaped seeds. Also, drink water, stay hydrated. Hmm. It's good to stay hydrated. This girl wants you to gather star seeds for a love charm that supposedly grants wishes. Last time I... I last time I, I did it a thing relating to a charm, I ended up in a cursed school, so never again. She said she'll need five of them. Uh, star seeds, I think they are uh, I think they're gathered on floor six, if I recall correctly. Either dropped from in me or gathered. I think gathered. She said she'll need five of them to complete the charm. It's kind of like pushing on a star in a way. Cute. Da kawaii this. I'm so sorry you had to hear that. Horticulture. Horticulture? Horchi. Horti. Horticulture. There we go. A stipulation in a millionaire's will requests the cultivation of a flower he could never get to bloom. Aww. There used to be an old man in Etria who grew lots of different types of flowers. I visited his garden now and then, and it always struck me as incredibly beautiful. I wish they would show a picture. Like a... you know, just a shot. I like flowers. Anyway. I heard the old man died the other day. Oh, well it happens, I guess. In his will, he asked that someone try to grow the only flower he could never raise. Which means he was never the perfect father. His last words were that he knew it bloomed in a certain place in the labyrinth, and only in the morning. But he found out that it was on the sixth floor. <laughs> no wonder he died. And of course, he was in no condition to go somewhere as dangerous as that. I have the flower seeds he left behind. Will you please give it a try? I know the old man will be rooting for you wherever he is now. Ha! <laughs> Get it? Rooting for root? You know, root. Because we're planting... Okay. It seems you've defeated the dreadful pack of wolves along with their leader, Fenrir. I thank you all. I thought, I thought you to be common novices, but you've grown into fine adventurers. It always lifts my spirits to see young adventurers growing stronger. Continue working hard to explore the forest while improving your skills. Ah yes, I almost forgot. For defeating Fenrir, we present a small reward to show our gratitude for all your hard work. 2k? 
Money. Oh yeah, in the end I never used the blaze oil. That would have been useful. So now you can use the geomagnetic field to teleport to the, you know, floor 6. So, yay. Alright. Back to mapping. <gasps> oh no, that's right. Oh no, this set of floors has the, the thing. Oh no, I just remembered. I don't know how to handle that. Alright, it's fuck. Sleep gels. So these things can put you to sleep. I know, nobody could have guessed. I'm a genius. They have really good defense. Honestly, these guys are not too bad. They have high defense, but like they don't hurt that bad. Okay, they hurt like hell. Oh my god. <gasps> No! Stop it! Oh, they're fast too! There's another of these doors. There's not really a point in reading the message again. I'm just gonna put the door and uh, move. That hurt a lot. Oh, as you walk through the forest, you reach a calm place where light shines through the trees. Standing here, you suddenly remember the quest you accepted at the pub. The quest to raise the flower entrusted to you to fulfill the old man's last wishes. This must be the place on the sixth floor that the old man had mentioned as suitable. Plant the seed here? Yes. You place the seed into the hole you dug, then begin to pack the earth back on top. As you concentrate on your work, you feel a sudden air of imminent threat. 
A swarm of bees ambush you. Oh no! Not the bees! Oh no. We even, we even get the second battle team from floor 16 and higher. Oof. Hearts. Oh, okay, in the back. Hit from in the back, in the back row. Why are they so fast? Oh my god, the, the poison? You can poison, you freaking jerk! Don't kill, don't kill, don't kill. Okay, battle ended. That works too. They poison those jerks. The, another wave of bees attacks. But, can I get a turn to heal outside of battle? Guess not. What the hell? <laughs> okay. It's pretty clear in my head now. These enemies just target the back row a lot. That has to be it. Or maybe they target troubadours a lot. Hey, I got a stinger. Yeah. Because she got killed, that means I got a stinger. Because she got stung, so the bee died. Anyway. Before you can catch your breath, the bees attack again. When does it end? Make it end, please! Oh god, the sleep gel. Oh no. Uh, let's kill the bees first, I guess. Stop murdering Bob. Oh, the poison. Oh, no. Crossing fingers that the poison... 43. Eh, it's bearable. Let's see. I don't have a Tyrica B. Should have bought one. Okay. All those misses. Don't kill. Okay, we good. Oh no! I don't get to heal now. Oh no! No more, please, no more. The swarm seems to be dying down. Thank God. Oh. <laughs> no. No! Oh, oh god, no. Ah. Uh. Despite his face, I'm sure his mom still likes him. <laughs> Roto. 
<laughs> You're not supposed to say that. I can't win against that. Not not anymore. Screw this. I'm out. I'm out. You cannot escape from this battle. I'll just gray out the escape button then. A <laughs> hundred thirteen. Uh, this is the end. This is the end. You're not alone in this, my friend. It's it's lyrics of a song. But yeah, this is the end. I have been murdered, the mur murdered, the dead, murder dead. I've, I've been murdered dead. rough maybe I'll wait for this quest maybe I'll do this quest at a later time yeah that's what I'm gonna do um, interesting game over song so, um, with this uh, wonderful performance that I just displayed, I, I will end the stream on that note. You know, ending on, on, a, on a downer, it's, it's a thing. It's, it's great. <laughs> uh... I might stream again later in the night, I don't know, but for now I I want to take a break, I want to go out for a walk and take a shower and uh, we'll see if I stream later. If not, then I'll be uh, doing nothing special with my life like usual. Okay, so that's gonna be the end of the stream. So I will export the video on my YouTube channel like usual. So if you're watching on YouTube right now, please give me a dislike. It's important. You have to do this for me. I beg you. All right. So, um, yeah, so I wish you a very good evening, and uh, just before the end, we're gonna get a random quote. Also, yes, I tapped out, so it's frozen. We get a random quote. Uh, the, the legend is true, the fish beat the duck. It, yeah, I, I, I remember that quote. I, uh, I said that while streaming, uh, what was it called? Uh, Super Indie Carts. It was a racing game with indie game characters. And I was playing the... Uh, I was playing either the fish or the duck character, and the fish beat the duck. So that's the context of that, that quote. Okay, so ending the stream. So thanks for watching. Have a good... Uh, day? It depends where you're in the world, you know? Anyway, take care. I'm waving right now. You don't see it because I don't use a cam. 